Start, how's it been? Getting out here, pun? It's been really exciting. Obviously, it's uh, it's been a really big transition for me from, from Australia, but um, uh, yeah, really looking forward to the, the opportunity, and it's great to be in spring ball now. And, I'm finally out here with pads and helmets and punting for the first time with, in front of, you know, live reps. So yeah, I'm loving it. How much did you know? Did you know about American football? I'm actually a massive fan of the sport, so I, I watched a lot of uh, NCAA college football back home, and um, I followed the New York Giants before I got here. That's going to have to change now, but um, certainly watched a lot of football. So um, I love the sport, and that's one of the main reasons why I wanted to get into it as well. Uh, did, did you realize you could be a punter? Uh, they probably realised that a couple of years ago. I was watching some of the punters and uh, we've got a couple of Australians that have played in the NFL, so um, I, I certainly aspired to be someone that does that. Um, and we've had footballers, Australian footballers transition from um, Australian football into the American football arena. So I realised a couple of years ago that it was an opportunity and then um, been on the path for that ever since. So. And how did it come about with Cal? I mean, who contacted who? Yeah, so I've uh, joined a, an organisation in Australia called Pro Kick Australia, and they, um, they're a, a pathway to getting uh, guys to NCAA Division One colleges. So um, I was lucky enough to work with them for 12 months, um, and they had a relationship with Coach Regal already, um, and the staff here with Steve Coots that was here. He came from the same program, um, Pro Kick, and uh, it was an easy transition. Coots was uh, uh, sort of graduating, and needed, they needed another punter here, so uh, I was next man in. So. Do you know Coach at all? I do, yep. I knew, we spoke uh, quite frequently before I came out here. Um, he's been a really, uh, uh, he's been really great, a great mentor for me, um, you know, in the months leading up to being here. And then since I've arrived, he's been fantastic. So um, I didn't know him personally before I got here, but we had communication, obviously, with social media and whatnot. So, um, yeah, he's been fantastic. Now, Aussie rules, that's even more physical than this, isn't it? Uh, I mean, I've seen some pretty big hits out here as well, but uh, we certainly, there's some big hits in our game. We don't wear pads or a helmet, so it's, um, and it's 360 degrees, you can get hit from all angles, so it's a very dangerous sport. We have a lot of concussions and it's something that the AFL is trying to improve as well, but uh, there's certainly big hits in both sports and I'm lucky as a punter, hopefully I don't have any, so. What's been your, what's, what have been some of the biggest changes for you taking live reps? in this versus Saucy Rules? Yeah, well, um, like I've played in front of thousands of people before in stadiums, so it's not that's not going to be something that's awfully new to me. Um, but in terms, obviously, it's a new sport, um, and just getting used to people coming at you with the, with the rush that happens um, when you're punting, people trying to block your punt. Um, but that's something it's actually very used to. Um, from Australian football, you have guys from 360 degrees trying to tackle and, and punt and block your ball. So. Uh, it's a little bit different. Obviously, I've got a helmet and pads on, but apart from that, there's, it's a pretty similar feeling. Cool. Thanks, Jameson. Thanks, guys. Thank Appreciate you. it. Thanks.